Mm. Joanna, I'd love to know why you brought... Nonisa. Nonisa here. I don't think we discussed it. Look, not everything is discussed. Some people choose to rather run away from situations. What does that statement mean? Well, Nonisa here is my girlfriend, as you know. I made a really stupid decision last night. And she met my friend. Let's not use words like stupid. We've been over this. Fine, 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 fine. I made a misinformed choice. And she met my friend. So next thing you know, I'm waiting with her for an Uber. And I happened to say, I think I love you, or whatever. Which is normal to say to someone, right? Like, after knowing them for three months. And guess what she did? She didn't say it back. Worse! Because it came out of nowhere, Joanna. I mean, I was just trying to go home and then you dropped this bomb on me. And we've never even spoken about being in love before. Okay, well, 1.1. This is not a marriage, Noni. We don't need to discuss things before they settle through. Now, what we're two, don't pretend you didn't send that voice note. What voice note? I plead the fifth, okay? Kenisa, do you know where you are? But I don't want to talk about it. Well, I do. So, what had happened was... Did I never come to Cape Town? I'm actually spending all my money coming to visit you. So, I think I want to say it. Look, I you know how you make me feel. Is it too soon? <laughs> Look, it's fine. I'm just gonna say it. I love you. Oh, too slow, don't come. Should not. I'm gonna buy you a ticket and you'll have no choice. Wow. Funny how you have an opinion about everything. But you have nothing to say now. I feel like you want me to feel a particular way and I'm just not feeling that way. I feel like we're going around in circles. Could we please just stop accusing each other and just speak on ourselves? Okay then, Joanna, you go first. How did you feel when Onisa ran away? <laughs> Honestly, I took it pretty well. Well, I still stand in saying that it was too soon. I mean, I meet your friends and now all of a sudden you love me? Mommy. I don't love you just because you made my friends. First of all, we're not in a good place, so don't call me that right now. Wow. I can't call you nicknames now, huh? What other rules would you like to make up for our relationship? I don't have rules, Joanna. Really? I can't tell you I love you. I can't, I can't call you nicknames because you're in a bad space. Everything has to happen after my feelings. And, like, what else, Noni? Noni, I'm, Noni, I'm, I need the bathroom. I should go apologize. I didn't mean all of that. I think you did. And that's okay. I do, however, think the way you said it needs work. Look, she's going through so much shit right now. And I shouldn't I shouldn't be making her feel bad about it. Like there's no there's no reason for me to be doing that. What about the shit you're going through? I didn't know therapists were allowed to swear. <laughs> I'm not your teacher, Joanna. Right. 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 Well, I do have a lot of shit going on, you know? I've only had peace jobs this whole year. I hate my house. I am a father. So, you know, there's that. But still, it doesn't mean that I should be yeah. treating... We've been over this. You can't make your problems seem less than just because other people are going through it. But I'm considerate, you know? So why not consider yourself? Stop psychoanalyzing me. Fine. Fine. 
I should consider myself. You know, I thought about it all of last week, or all of yesterday, and... The thing is, I just looked at her running away as some fucked up analogy of, you know, her running away from this entire relationship. I try to make plans about the future, try to express plans, and she says some weird shit like, oh, we'll see. Come on, I, I literally tried to get us some Afropunk tickets and she said, no, it's too, it's too soon to plan that far into the future. I was like, it's Afropunk though. You know how much planning goes into Afropunk, Tamiwe? Come on. I know what Afropunk is. Right, so you know how important it is, these things, you know, like setting dates and planning outfits and where we're gonna stay and- Joanna? I, I, I have to break up with her. Why? She never liked me. I knew that from, from the start. If anything, our relationship is meant to be a fling. Just be friends and just keep it moving. I'm glad you realized that on your own. It was pretty obvious, right? I just, I, I like things. I like things a lot. And this one month with, with her, it's, it's felt like a whole year of drama. Let's not focus on that. You tried something new and now you've learned to listen. Do you think she's crying? What do you think? I think she left. Do you think she left? Maybe. You know what? I'm just gonna go to a place and break up with her, you know? It's like the decent thing to do, right? What is it? She broke up with me. How are you feeling? Honestly. Kind of pissed. Yeah. She wouldn't even let me have this. I really thought I'd say this, but baby, I fucked up. Come so far. I should have never left the light and said I'm going to my friends. So I fucked up. Been up all night, just keep on crying Down in a dream, can't sleep Been up all night, just keep on crying Down in a dream